Now, Kelly Osborne has opened up about losing six stone uh, through a combination of having a gastric sleeve fitted and taking up a new healthy diet and exercise regime. And that she's not the only celebrity to make the front pages recently because of weight loss. There's Adele. I think she posted that picture on her 30th birthday. She didn't say anything, just apart from, you know, it's my yes. 30th birthday. And literally the world went mad about the weight loss. It's um, suggested that she's lost seven stone because she doesn't talk about it. Um, also, American actress Rebel Wilson, she's recently posted pictures of her. She's uh, lost four stone, I believe. And, of course, when we see pictures of, you know, we, they're very, very well-known people and often they've talked about their struggles with weight. And so when they do suddenly post a picture of, you know, having lost stones in weight, we all want to know how did they do it. The thing is, should they be allowed to keep that themselves to themselves and be private? Or, Kelly, is it their duty to their fans to kind of tell us their secret? I think there's a really fine line because especially if your audience is, you know, a younger a target market, for example, when I was in the band, you know, a lot of the people that bought our records were younger girls. And I think there I do, I do, I took it on myself to have a responsibility in terms of what I was portraying to those to those younger fans because they are very impressionable. And also they're not thinking about things like, you know, photoshopping of a picture and and like what we now have as filters, which is why I'm really conscious of sometimes posting pictures of me without makeup. Mm. I think it's really important that we stress the fact that these pictures that we see of each other or of, of people that we idolise are snapshots and not actually the whole picture. Um, so for myself personally, I'm really conscious of that because I, I really want to... I know that young minds can be really impressionable. And for example, for me, I, during lockdown, I was running. And so, um, and I'd take, you know, I'd do an, an Instagram live whilst I'm running. Um, and it's inspired other people to get fit and get healthy, you know, and I've had people contact me and say, you know, I've actually started running now and, and I'm starting to look after my body. I just think it's really important but that's to kind of my that, point, though, Kate. That that's kind with... of my point, uh, Janet. You know, when people... When you post something, we all do it. You know, I post things. I started skipping in lockdown. Mm -hmm. Then if you suddenly start losing lots of weight, people are going to ask, aren't they? So they've seen you do your skipping. What else are you doing, Kelly? And, you know, so is it... Is it your right to just keep that to yourself or should you share? Should these celebrities share? If I you're think going to post, put it yes, out there. Yes, but if they're taking money for diet supplements mm. or they're accepting sponsorship or free training, I just think don't pretend that you... Because quite often, I'm not naming any names here, people have claimed they've lost weight and then we've subsequently found out they've had surgery yeah. or or whatever. I, personally, I'm not comfortable with offering people advice uh, beyond saying I like walking. I mean, mm. I put a, a picture on Twitter the other day of two scenes in the countryside and I just said, this is why I walk every day, for the mental, for peace and quiet, yeah. really. Well, I, 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 I think giving people tips about getting healthy, getting fit, is the fine line as Kelly has said, between what makes you feel good and what becomes yeah. compulsive what, behaviour in other people. However, life has changed in terms, not that long ago since Anne Diamond got an absolute pasting in yes. all the papers because she didn't own up to having a gastric mm -hmm. band. Nowadays, I think, I mean, Kelly looks amazing. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, I'm not so sure about Adele. I don't recognise Adele in a way yet. Uh, but the thing is that um, people, they're proud of their bodies sometimes and that if they want to talk about it, why not, even without the, yeah. the whole aspect of money attached yeah, to well, it? Yeah, well, we did the body confidence... Yeah. Uh, we did the body confidence photos in our swimsuits that not, the point of that was to say we're proud of all the shapes we are. Yeah. I don't want people to be channelled into thinking only a thinner shape is better. Yeah. Well, Kelly says, you know, she was very honest about it and just said, you know, I guess I've had a gastric sleeve, but I've been doing this for two years. Yeah, because she she's done be. diet and exercise yes. as well.